right, everybody, here we go. Gonna get this 150cc engine. Into the mini Jeep. Here we go. Alrighty. go we'll start with that last bolt out in the back what I'm gonna do is lift up on the front of the engine I'm trying to line it up right here new these new bushings are a little bit thicker I think it's gonna fit. Do you think it's gonna fit? There we go. Like a glove. Yeah, yeah. All right, we're gonna put the uh, four motor mount bolts back in. You're gonna take that lock washer first, followed by the flat washer. Best way to do it is probably just if you're strong enough, pick the motor up. From over here by the head, and just kind of <clears throat> give it a little more play. There we go. First things first, let's just go back in reverse order and hook the chain up. Just so you this is a stock tooth. Versus the newer tooth. So it is different. So this definitely goes here. We're gonna loop it back through. And then this one, as you see, mm -mm, comes with uh, different connectors than this one. So we're going to have to do some modification to this plug um, and use the old connector. So it's, I'm sure you could just splice these in if you wanted to, uh, but I have a nice soldering iron, so I'm just going to solder them in here in a little bit. Um, and then I'll put some shrink wrap back over them and uh, cover that back up. So I'll show you how I'll do that here in a little bit. I cut the old plug off and left about that much space on it. And basically... We're just going to match up these colors to here. All right, next we're just going to strip some wires, get them ready to splice in and solder. Take five of those. I'm just going to slip them on top of these for right now. Alright. Let's solder up the connectors real quick. And a little J hook. So, take that. Hook it back in. A little flux on it. If you don't put flux on it, the solder's not going to stick. I love to use these little Kester. They're 60 40, tin and lead. And they're awesome. You just kind of pull it out like this. Next, we're going to put the 
elbow to the carburetor back on. All right, go ahead and line that gasket back up. Tighten that back up with the 5 16 wrench, our socket. Here you go ahead and put the spark plug wire back on the spark plug. We got our carburetor elbow back in. We got our carburetor all back on, installed. Fuel tubes. Good to go. Next we're gonna finish hooking up the starter. Alright, next thing we're gonna do is put the exhaust pipes back on. Next thing we're gonna do is put the exhaust pipe back on right up here. Just gonna take it. Give it a nice push up there. Get our elbow back up. Step is we need to take this old shifter linkage off, put it back on the new 150cc engine we got. 10 millimeter bolt. So we're going to take that. And I'm just going to tighten that bolt back up. step just take that breather that we took off earlier and reconnect it to the back of that motor take the negative and hook it up right here just a ground just gonna take this top bolt off to run your negative starter wire that's the old bolt. We don't need that. We already have this bolt, so slide that in. Connect that back up. It's 5 16 And just cover it up. All done. So, put that chain back through, and you'll take this piece and slide it on, and you're going to turn it to line those bolts up, and then pull that chain and everything back towards it. Second. All right, then get your 10 millimeter socket. Just finish tighten them down. All right, all done. Now you got your.
sprocket back on with your two bolts and that spacer that holds it together. Like I said, you just push that in there and you rotate it and then pull that sprocket back out towards it in a locking position. Then you just tighten it down. All right, so you can take your chain cover and your two by 16th bolt. Chain cover plate finished. Have to move a little bit of that shroud stuff out of the way. I'm just going to cut it up a little bit. All right, now let's get back underneath here and finish hooking up the shifter linkage and the chain tensioner. That's my dog. My dog over there getting into stuff. <laughs> Will you cut it out over there? Oh, she's crazy. She's the English master. Told you. Look at that. Dude! Dude! Chill out! She likes to do this when I'm under cars and stuff, working on stuff. She's insane. Look, oh. <laughs> yep, she just ran into me. Hey, cut it out. Get off me. <laughs> Hold on a minute. I'll play in a minute. Alrighty. Now your shifter link is back together. Just a 10 millimeter and a 12 millimeter. Now we're going to come back over here and hook up our chain tensioner again. All done there. So you put your bolt, bolt, spring, slide it through the arm, your bushing, then your gear. Slide it through, spring, nut, tighten it down. Everything's working good. All right, and you're gonna take your new wire. Oh, you know what that sound is. That's the 150cc alive. Oh yeah. Runs like a dream. Great.